represent as a team. Is it, like Friday night, was this a case of the defense leading into, turning into easier baskets on offense? We, we, um, we have obviously good offensive players, and you know we have to continue taking pride in our defense, and you know they hope, hopefully that continues to generate a little offense for us and easy buckets. Uh, when we get out there, it's not all about just fast break points. It's about not letting their defense get set. I think that's when we're at our best when we're doing random pick and rolls, and uh, you know our bigs are ducking in versus their bigs, and uh, you know get us easy, easy shots and uh, good looks at the best. Jimmy, rookie, rookie guard, he had some of those infectious plays. You think they had an effect on guys and they dove on the floor and yeah. chased down the yeah, we, we need guys to come in uh, with that type of energy and that type of uh, mindset. You know. Somebody has to get down and dirty, and, you know, kind of it, it, those type of things are contagious. Uh, you said, you know, I let him have that block, though. <laughs> Was this an opponent considering that they played three straight games that had gone at least one overtime? Did you think you could be more energetic than them? Uh, well, you know, we can't focus on what's going on in anybody else's locker room. Our, our focus is our locker room, and, and we'll be in control. Uh, you know. Our energy level is high, and uh, we have to keep it that way right now. You know, we can't even have, have any letdowns, no matter who we're playing, because the game isn't going to be perfect for it. It doesn't come easy. We're not the type of team who can just uh, you know, rely on one guy or one thing. We have to do everything uh, pretty good. How much would it mean after the way this homestand started, if you could pull out a win on Tuesday night and manage up? You know, we just take it one game at a time, and, you know, I, I don't, you know, Look at any one game bigger than any other. Game. You know, we just have to go out and prepare and and, and uh, focus on the task at hand. And, and, you know, that's uh, going to stay. How encouraging is two wins in a row? It's good. It's good to be, be uh, you know on a win streak. You know, we're, we've been on the other end of it a lot, and you know, like, um, you know, we enjoy this one for a couple of hours, and we get back to work tomorrow and prepare for the next opponent. What was it like for you to defend against a guy who's six six? But have a tall quarter. I mean, it's nothing new. I mean, um, just go out there and give the effort, no matter who. I mean, I've been playing against guys all year at that at that height, uh, and uh, just trying to make it tough on them as much as I can. Use my leverage and my strength. Aaron was saying that some of your bosses, you guys have been sort of right there, yes. and now you guys are extending the other teams. Well, it's a process. It's a process to learn how to win. Uh, you don't just put a team out there and, and you know you're going to win. You have to you have to learn the, learn the course and state of course, you know, when things get tough for you and, and um, you know, uh, you have those bad nights offensively, you, you have to rely on your energy and your defense and, um, you know, lately we've been shooting the ball well and, and our defense has been there for us, you know, uh, for the most part of those games. How important was it to, to build off of Friday's Friday's win and do a lot of the same things again and get, get the results? Uh, it's extremely important to build off everything. Uh, you know, we, we have to learn, uh, like I said, how to win. We have to learn from our mistakes as well as we go through them. We have so many young guys, um, you know, have, haven't been through the situations that I've been through. So they have to go through those situations and figure things out. Um, and, you, know, you know, so far they're doing a good job. And, you know, but, you know, one thing we have to do is continue when we're watching film. We just take those film sessions serious and those and these shoot arounds. Um, Serious to learn things. You're not going to be able to practice for three hours a day and you know break down everything in those in those practices. Jameer, it seemed like Atlanta stuck around today because of the three-point shooting. They were 12, 12 of 26 going into the fourth quarter, and you guys hold them to three for 13 from deep uh, at the end of the fourth. What what changed in the three-point defense, if anything? Uh, we just gave the effort. Uh, we were you know keen keen on that thing. You know that, that three-point line from the beginning. We knew they were going to shoot a lot of threes. Um, you know, going into the game, and we just had to focus on it. And, and uh, you know, we know it's a big part of their game with Horford out. All right. Thanks, Thanks,